Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today's video, um, I'm just doing a unboxing and a review of the premium comic mystery box. Now this is a £40 mystery box from a website called comicbox.co.uk. Um, it's not affiliated, so I'm not affiliated whatsoever with the website and it's not sponsored. So this will just be my own personal opinion on the mystery box. And if it might be worth your guys' money. So what I'll do is I'll quickly go through. I'll show you the website and I'll show you what comic box it is. We'll go through what you get in the box. And then I will crack this bad boy open. And we'll have a look at what we get. Okay. So the website itself is called comicbox.co.uk. And they do various boxes on here. Um, from Marvel, DC, Indie and Mixes. And they do graded boxes as well and graded comics. Now, the one I've got today is the Premium Mystery Comic Box, and it's £40. And for that £40, you get 20 comics from Marvel, DC, or a mix of both. You get two Silver Age comics. You get a couple of A1 comic posters, a trade paperback, and a promo pack. Now, that includes 10 additional comics as well. Um, you also get tracked shipping with that order. Let's get into this and see what we've got. You get the 20 Marvel DC on mixed comics. Now I went for the Marvel box. Um, so this will be 20 mixed Marvel comics. Um, we've also got the trade paperback. Spider-Man, this is volume 12, again sealed, so that's cool, just place that down there, and we'll go through this stack of comics first. Once you've gone through those, you get the additional pack of comics in there, the 10 pack. And then we have the Silver Age books here too, so we'll go through those shortly. So the first book we've got is Marvel Black Knight issue one. Looks cool. And I think what I'll do is if I remember, I'll put a tally of how much the the books are worth and to see if this is kind of financially a good pickup. We've got Iron Man there. And these all seem to be nice condition. Bagged and boarded. Very well packaged. And we've got Guardians of the Galaxy, number six. This one. Star Lord, so Black Vortex. Chapter 9. That's a cool cover. So the Captain Britain annual there. A nice mix of reading material in here. This is a cool one. So we've got um, the end Wolverine. Issue 8. And we have the Death of Wolverine, Logan Legacy number six. I mean, so far these are kind of one, two pound books, maybe three pound books. So it does all mount up. We've got Cable 151. We've got X-Men there, Uncanny X-Men 14. And we have another issue, number 15, so that's good. That's a cool cover, I like that. Paper there. 
and we have X-Men 95. So these seem to be nice books. I'm happy with these so far. And we have another X-Men, number 96. And we have X-Force 23. Again, another nice condition book. Then we have Generation X 47. It seems quite um, X-Men related so far. Which I'm not going to grumble about. Oh, there we are. We have um, Captain America Bloodstone Hunt, part one of six. That's a cool one. And Captain America 351. And then we have a Captain Britain Secret Invasion issue 2. Pretty cool. I've not actually read any Captain Britain books before. We have a Valkyrie issue number 1. It's always cool like to get issue number ones of the series. I mean, initially, already these would be really good for somebody who just likes to read a variation of books. So we've got um, Daredevil, Man Without Fear 101. It's a cool cover. And the last one from the 20 is. King Thor, issue number four. I think I actually needed that one. Did um got a few King Thors in a collection I picked up recently. That's a good pickup. So we also got the, the additional ten comics. So I'll get into these. We'll have a look what they are. Um, the I did forget to mention. I think the minimum value of these boxes is fifty five pounds. So regardless of what you get, it's a pretty good buy. So I just opened up the ten additional comics. Nineties kids will love this. Some nice foil action. We've got the Avengers. Is it 363? Nice. That's this must be an Avengers pack, I think. And then we have 359. We have Dark Rain, the Mighty Avengers 21. It's a cool cover. Dark Avengers issue four. So it's a very nice selection so far. We have a Dark Avengers 16. Avengers 357 Issue 356 Then we have a 355 so it's a nice nice little run there Avengers Couple more, I think. So we have Avengers Empire issue one. That's the issue one there. Then Secret Avengers issue three. 
the cool cover like that. So we also got the um the Silver Age comics as well. So I'll get them out now. Can paper all over. Like that. So that was um Captain Marvel issue eleven. Challenges of the Unknown, issue 48. It's an awesome bit of art. Let's have a look. What else do we have? So I think it's the posters. So let's have a look. So I might not actually be able to open this. I have a lot of space on my desk at the moment. So we have one. Let's see what this one is. One already. Get it open. What you call Doctor Strange. Things are huge. I think they are A1, I believe. That's cool. This little, um, One limb art print there as well. So that is it, guys. Um, plenty of selection. Again, there's a Marvel, DC, Indie, um, and you get at least so you've got a 20, 20 books, and then you've got a pack of ten. And then you've got the two Silver Age books as well. So I mean, it's thirty-two comics. And then a couple of Silver Age ones as well. So obviously you get the you get Silver Age comics. So it makes 32 plus the posters. So I mean price wise, definitely worth the 40 pounds. Um I've got free shipping as well. I'll check out you can put in a code to get free shipping. So I'm happy with that. I think it's worth the money. Let me know what you think. And uh, what I'll do is I'll I'll drop the um website down below as well and check out the site. Um, the, the owner's a really good guy. I've had a chat with him before. Um, and there's a lot of selection there. So yeah, that is it. Take care, guys.